Yeah, welcome back to another little diversionary review. I've been looking at small bodied, small scale uh, guitars for those ukulele players who are keen to make that transition but daunted by the big dreadnoughts. So the little little ones, travel guitars, things like that. Sorry I didn't do one last week. I've done a couple before, didn't do one last week. The heat wave in the UK was ridiculous. I could not have sat in this room. It's still pretty warm now. Um, but here we are, back on. I've got a few more of these to show you. This brand, this is the Yamaha APX T2 electric acoustic and it is a shrunk down version oh my word the fingerprints i've been playing this a lot i'll come on to why this is a shrunk down version of their bigger apx shaped guitar which i believe is one of the best selling acoustic electrics of all time and i absolutely love this modern shape of it with this big fat bass and swoopy shoulder oval sound hole um and skinny front to back skinny front to back it's a it's a small little instrument really really nice to sort of cradle very very small not much bigger than a baritone ukulele um, this one in this sunburst finish in red comes in a bunch of other colors this is laminate spruce on the top laminate unspecified locally sourced wood they say on the back and sides in this flat color um, and I love that contrast I think it's a really attractive instrument I'm not so much a fan of the size of the rosewood uh, bridge, which is massive, uh, but there we are, plastic pins, plastic saddle. This comes, you don't get a choice of acoustic only, it comes with a side-mounted active pickup system. I'm not normally a fan of those, don't mind them so much on a guitar because the weight differential is not that noticeable. What I don't like about this is it runs on AA batteries rather than cells, which will mean you're buying batteries a lot. Uh, but what I do like about it, and I'm not going to plug it in because you're just listening to my amplifier, depends what amplifier you use, it's an ART system which Yamaha are famous for. It's not an under saddle, it's attached to the bracing and it gives it a much more natural uh, microphonic sound rather than the quacky pizza. Really, really nice. I've plugged it in. It sounds very, very good and very easy to shape. The neck uh, wood I don't think is specified, more locally sourced tone wood. Um, this is a longer scale affair than the Jim Dandy. This is uh, 21 frets joined at the 14th and you feel that in the length but it is skinnier at the nut at 41 so it's and, and the body's so small. It's diminutive, tiny little thing. Uh, all very good condition here, no sharp fret ends, dots in the usual places. The usual Yamaha logo, very boring the Yamaha logo isn't it but that's what it is. Um, with a flat back facing, black facing and these sort of vintage style geared tuners. Comes with a set of 12s, I think they're Dodario strings, next to useless padded gig bag. And these are about 200 pounds, which isn't a lot of money. It's more than that Jim Dandy, but it's not a lot of money, bearing in mind you're also getting the pickup system on this. And I've read a lot of stories of people who use these as stage guitars, because they sound so good plugged in. Those same people say they can sound a bit thin uh, and a bit bright acoustically. And I would agree with them. I would agree with them. like it because you know it's a small instrument I've just been sitting this why it's covered in fingerprints I've been sitting in the garden just in the garden chair just noodling really taken a shine to this, really taken a shine to it, just because it's so damn comfortable to sit and hold and play. Um, it's, 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 I could, it sounds much better plugged in, take my word for that, I can assure you. But still, you know, for, for just sitting and, and noodling in at home, nice and quiet if you wanted to.
Yeah, I really like this one. The Yamaha APX T2, did I say what the price was? About 200 quid, uh, not a lot of money. Made in Indonesia, what well, haven't I told you? It's all laminate, pickup system comes as standard, loads of colors, great brand, very reliable, very, very playable. Very, very playable. And I quite like the sound actually, it's not, it was never gonna be dreadnought sound with a body this size, but it's tiny, isn't it? Um, yeah, really enjoyed that one. Okay, uh, I am back this weekend with the ukulele review, and then I think I've got a couple more of these mini guitars, maybe two or three, coming over the next few weeks when I get the time. Uh, so I will see you at the weekend. Thanks for your ongoing support, and thanks for watching. Take care, everyone. Have a good night. Bye-bye.